the treatment, uh, both the uh, treatment with regards to boosting your iman, knowing what you're doing is haram, and the proper treatment of how to eliminate this habit from your life, how to overcome this. I mentioned before to the boys, to the brothers who asked about this repeatedly, and I said, one advice is do not stay alone. Do not live alone. Do not travel alone. Do not spend plenty of time alone by yourself. Because the Prophet said, لا يسافرن أحدكم وحده ولا ينامن أو يبيتن وحده When you are alone, you are an easy hunt for a shaitan. Like the stray uh, 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 sheep is an easy hunt for uh, the wolf. Number two, a person only tends to do that when the iman level decreases. So as long as you keep the iman level up, it's very hard for the shaitan to convince you. So every time the shaitan comes to you to whisper to you, to make you think and reflect upon an image that you've seen or a porn site that you've been browsing or, 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 وَإِمَّا يَنْزَغَنَّكَ مِنَ الشَّيْطَانِ نَزْغٌ فَاسْتَعِذْ بِاللَّهِ Right away, seek refuge with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Recite the Quran. Get up and make wudu. Make wudu, the shaitan will flee. It would be best if you can offer two rak'ahs. Then open the Quran and recite as much Quran as you can. Or make istighfar. Or simply put your sneakers on, step out and walk. Or jog. Or if you have an exercise room, do some physical exercise so that it will exhaust you. Most of those who are indulged into this are not into physical exercise. They're easy hunt also. So the, the, the treatment of the problem has uh, two parallel ways. It's not only by giving the advices and increasing your iman. And, no, there's a lot in your life which is not occupied. Occupied. Do as much as you can of physical exercise. Occupy yourself by reading useful materials. And uh, as you said, you Googled it. Uh, it is very important to know the medical danger and uh, the side effects of having such, uh, of practicing such a, a, an evil and uh, bad practice and getting used to it and addicting such thing. I'm glad she confessed to you and uh, she sought your help. Uh, every once in a while when you find a useful material, an audio or video or written material, print it, copy it and give it to her. We need to work on increasing the level of Iman. Uh, stay together as much as you can. Do not stay by yourself. If you know that whenever you are by yourself, the shaitan whispers to you. So defeat the shaitan by always keeping yourself in a good company. Maintain the regular prayer on time. And pray nawafil as much as you can. And the best advice before the end of the program, frequent fasting. I know that in London, you get to fast like for over 20 hours because uh, the, the Maghrib time is very late and the Fajr is very early. May Allah uh, help you guys uh, just return and I found it very difficult, but may Allah give you help. Fasting, fasting uh, is advised by the Prophet Sallallahu in order to decrease that evil desire and the shahwa. He said, oh young men, if you can get married, if you can afford it, get married. If you can't, then adhere to fasting. It is the best means of protection. Uh, if I were you, I would speak to my dad or to my mom that I want to get married. 18 is a marriageable age. I understand that in London, in the UK, 16 is the legal age of marriage. So if there is a good person, a good candidate, uh, speak to the imam, speak to your family members, get married. That is the ultimate solution to this uh, problem. And hopefully, inshallah, I hope inshallah one day we'll invite a psychiatrist in order also to handle this from a psychiatric point of view. Are you tired of all these annoying ads on YouTube? Are you worried that a haram video might pop up? Well, the One Islam TV app is here to solve these problems, inshallah. The One Islam TV app is 100% free of any ads and is safe to browse for your peace of mind. Watch or listen to lectures and lessons while you work, rest, or drive with your device switched off. Watch videos on demand or download videos and watch offline. Watch hundreds of high quality produced Islamic reminders, Quran learning videos, stories of the prophets, and so much more. 
two to four new videos uploaded daily, inshallah. One Islam TV is 100% run and owned by Muslims, which means a small amount you pay for your subscription is a sadaqa jariya, continuous charity for you as we use the funds raised to continue producing more beneficial videos and reminders, inshallah. The One Islam TV app is now available on Apple devices, Apple TV, Android devices, Android TV, Amazon Fire TV, and Roku so you can watch on most devices and smart TVs. Download now for a free 7-day trial. May Allah reward you for supporting our work.